we come from a theater background. So, you know, that, that's kind of how we already write. You know, we like to write um, a song that sort of has a beginning, a middle and an end, you know, that, that um, you know, even when we're writing up a, a pop song, it probably hardly ever just stays exactly the same chorus all the way through. We're gonna develop that, that be, and that's just the way we think about things. And I think that's also what helps us really write, a, I, I think, a better song. And um, you know what Tom was getting at earlier. It's it's great because Amy and Dan um, and Robin they look to us a little bit to help do that. You know, so it's it's you know and and you know to get more specific, like as Tom says, we actually do really try to think about it. And Tom specifically, you should jump in here, Tom, because you actually really <laughs> think about being you you embody the character a lot when you're thinking about the words, right? I mean, yeah, absolutely. I mean, like with Harry, just thinking about what kind of jokes he would tell and what sort of like fun they would poke. At shy that would help us also sort of you know ultimately the question of that song is why are they getting married how did how did monica pull this off and we as a storytellers also know that well the actually the answer is it's a payoff it's like this is a, an arranged thing and so there's always that in the back of your head through that song just there's that layer of joy hopefully of, or sadness in that case of right. oh they're making fun of this maybe monica did this maybe monica did that and the answer is well maybe monica got paid with a royalty check and a house um, that's the actual answer and so that's the fun of that and the same for like city lights we got to there was one line in the script that opened it up for us which was um that reggie shy's manager wrote the song and that suddenly you're like, oh, Reggie's out of the picture and he gets to write this one song to put in his friend's mouth about where's your real home? You know, there's a line in the song, which is, uh, baby, you are my home. And when you think that Reggie wrote that, for us, you may never notice that, you don't have to, but it adds a layer hopefully for the actors and a layer of something for the audience to get. 